I think I hear a baby deer, and I'm going to see if I can go and find him. That's Mama right there. I don't know if you can see her. I think that's Mama. Okay. Here's a baby fawn caught in the fence. Yeah, poor little guy. Oh, look at that. Poor thing's bone is exposed, damn it. Look at that. Oh, poor guy. Okay. Let's try and get you out, buddy. I got some wire cutters with me. I'm gonna cut this piece of fence in a way. Yeah, I got them tied up. I'm gonna I'm gonna put them in the tack room and come back with some iodine and uh, some wound care material for that leg of his. Yeah, I got him drinking some water. Let's see if I can do that again. He's thirsty. Okay, so as you can tell, he's in pretty bad shape. He's definitely got lots of bone exposed on that wound from being caught in the fence. I got um, some LA 200 liquamycin, a, uh, it's an antibiotic for, uh, for the sheep and goats. So I'm going to give him a shot of that and, uh, throw a little dressing on that wound and let him go and wish him luck. And, uh, like I said, I don't think he's going to, he's going to make it, but I will uh, get this wound dressed up, give him an antibiotic shot and, uh, put him back where I found him. And we got some some needles and a syringe, and uh, we're gonna give him a shot of this uh, LA two hundred uh, liquamycin here. All right, just give him a couple CCs of uh, the LA two hundred. He didn't put up a fight at all. He took it pretty nice actually. And I got some of this uh, Simply Saline uh, wound care spray too, which. Uh, you know, I figure it's probably better than what he's going to get uh, out in the woods. So I guess it can't hurt. I'm going to spray a little bit of this on his wound. Just got done dousing it in some hydrogen peroxide here. And as you can tell, it's foaming up pretty good. Like I said, I mean, I think this is just to kind of make him more comfortable. I really don't think he's going to make it, but uh, there's no harm in trying. And uh, let's give this a spray. Let's see if this... So I got some iodine on the wound here. I'm gonna take and just dress this guy up with one of these gauze pieces here. I'm gonna wrap it with this. All right, now let's put some of this uh, some of this stuff here. This tape is perforated, which is nice. It's the first fawn bandage I have ever done. So, uh, got his antibiotics, got him dressed up, and then now I'm gonna go and uh, I'm gonna let him go. He's sleeping now. Drink a bunch of water. Well, he looks comfortable. I don't know. We'll, we'll be able to.
to tell here in a minute. Okay, let's take them back out where we found them. There's a thirsty, thirsty farm. Got him eating some ferns. <laughs> Probably a good sign, huh? Standing now. There's its mama over there, way out there, it's as far as I can zoom, and he's right here. Right there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna let him go. See you later.